Greetings, fellow YouTubers. Today is um, August 23rd, 2011. Um, we can see now that, in theory, uh, this second large object is causing um, an induction on the sun itself, causing it to expand um, to a much greater mass um, than it has in the past. Today, the sun is almost two times as hot, as big as it was in 2009. What this says is that the objects that come close together have compressed space and time and therefore the induction is caused by um, the neutrino effect. There doesn't seem to be much obstruction here uh, due to chemtrails today. Um, as the sun uh, descends in the uh, west, um, we may see some uh, chemtrails appear uh, before another half an hour to an hour before twilight. Interesting effect there of, as of the sun pulsing. Solar flares are, are flaring off the top. Do we get any reflection? Do we have any sun dogs here? The second object passing very closely to the sun. Someone had suggested a M-class star carbon star, which is a very interesting concept. M-class stars are red, and they have a uh, carbon-based atmosphere, which um, then changes uh, molecularly, on the molecular level in the atmosphere and to other types of carbon. Um, could life have been formed by a carbon star? The sun has a certain amount of carbon and creates carbon. 